To begin Trevor Zegers' career simulation at 20 years old, he's looking to help the Anaheim Ducks get back to greatness. It was an impressive rookie campaign for Trevor, who's potting 29 goals and 33 helpers for 62 points. Anaheim's also looking impressive, finishing with a record of 48, 30, and 4, and they're taking on the Calgary Flames in the first round. When the first round came to an end, Calgary would be too much to handle and the Ducks are falling in 5 games. Zegers wasn't too impressive in the playoffs, scoring only 3 points while being minus 6. Trevor is going to take home a bit of hardware though, as he's winning the Calder Trophy. Heading into this season, big things are expected from Zegers. He's making a massive jump to an 88 overall, and he's ready to put the league on notice. It was a slightly better year for Trevor. He's scoring 20 goals and 49 assists for 69 points, and with a 45, 24, and 12 record, the Ducks are looking to make some noise in the postseason. And they definitely made some noise, because here we are, the Stanley Cup Final, the Anaheim Ducks are taking on the Philadelphia Flyers. Once the series came to an end, the Ducks are coming out on top as Stanley Cup champions in 5 games. Trevor was terrific in the playoffs, scoring 4 goals and 15 helpers for 19 points in 22 games. After winning the Stanley Cup last season, Anaheim's looking to build off that momentum and they want to go back to back. It was a disappointing year for everyone on the team. Trevor did finish as the team leader in points, but he had a career low 61 points. Coming off the of Stanley Cup, expectations for this team were sky high. Sadly, that's not going to happen as this team's missing the playoffs with a 34, 41, and 7 record. The fact that this team went from Stanley Cup champs to missing the playoffs is wild. But you know what else is wild? The fact that 75% of the people that are watching these videos aren't subscribed. Man, that's crazy. What are you doing? Subscribe right now. I'm trying to hit 5,000 subs by the end of the year, and I can't do that if you haven't subscribed. So come on, man. Hit the button. And while you're at it, drop a like too. Let's get 500 likes on this video. The goal for this season isn't to win a championship. It's to make the playoffs. Oh yeah, we also made a huge move signing Pasta. It was a solid bounce back year for Zegras, who's potting 38 goals and 37 helpers for 75 points. Anaheim's also back where they should be, with a record of 42, 35, and 5, and they're taking on the Chicago Blackhawks in the first round. In a tough 7 game series versus the Blackhawks, the Ducks are falling in the first round. Trevor did everything he could, scoring 3 goals and 8 assists for 11 points. It's time to get the team back on track. We made the playoffs last season, now we have to get back to the Stanley Cup. At 25 years old, Trevor Zegers is finally having his breakout season, scoring a career-high 90 points, consisting of 31 goals and 59 assists. But even though Zegers is having a breakout year, the team isn't going to see any success from that, as they're finishing with a disappointing 40-34-8 record, and that disappointment is going to continue in the playoffs as the Flames are taking us down in 6 games. When it mattered most, Zegers disappears, scoring only 1 goal and 1 assist for 2 points. A Boston reunion slowly developing in Anaheim as Brad Marchant's joining Zegers and Pasta on the first line. It was a solid year for Trevor scoring 25 goals while picking up 55 assists for 80 points in 82 games. Even though the top line combined for 94 goals, that's not going to be enough and the Ducks are missing the playoffs with a 40, 37, and 5 record. This team has been extremely underwhelming ever since they won a Stanley Cup. It's time to get back to our Stanley Cup form and win ourselves another Stanley Cup. Even though this team continues to struggle, Zegers is going to be the bright light for them. He's scoring 27 goals while picking up 63 assists for 90 points. With a record of 42, 34, and 6, Anaheim's taken on the Vancouver Canucks in the first round. Vancouver would be too much to handle, and the Ducks are falling to the eventual Stanley Cup champs in 7 games. Trevor was better in the playoffs this season, but I'm still expecting more from him. With one year remaining on his contract, the future of Trevor Zegers and the Anaheim Ducks is up in the air. If this team doesn't turn it around this season, I expect Zegers in a new jersey next year. Trevor had himself a great year, scoring 84 points consisting of 32 2 goals and 52 assists. With a record of 42, 33, and 7, and what could be his final playoff run with the Ducks, let's get one more Stanley Cup together. The Ducks stood no chance against the eventual Stanley Cup Las Vegas Golden Knights, and to be fair, this team was incredible, going 16-2 in the playoffs. Trevor was mid in the playoffs, only recording 3 assists. In free agency, Trevor Zegers decided his time in Anaheim has come to an end, and he's joined the Philadelphia Flyers. I think Philly's in a better position than Anaheim, but who knows what this team's going to look like in 5 years. After securing the bag, Zegers is having a slower year, scoring only 30 goals and 41 assists for 71 points. With the addition of Trevor Zegers, Zegers, Philly's performing very similar to how Anaheim did with him, finishing with a 40, 35, and 7 record, and similar to the Ducks, Philly's falling in the first round to the New York Rangers. It was a decent postseason for Trevor though, he's picking up 6 points in 7 games. Heading into this season, everyone's looking for more. Zegers wants to get back to his 90 point form, while Philly, they want to make a deep playoff run. Not only did Trevor get back to his 90 point form, 
he actually had a career year, scoring 42 goals and picking up 54 helpers for 96 points. And the Flyers are also looking better. They're finishing with a 45, 32, and 5 record. But as we know, the regular season doesn't mean anything when we come into the playoffs, as Phillies fall into the eventual Stanley Cup champion Montreal Canadiens in the first round. Seagrass didn't have the best playoff series, but let's face it, no one on this team did. After two straight seasons of getting bounced in the first round, Philly's willing to do anything to get past the first round. Trevor's having another solid year, finishing with 42 goals and 40 assists for 82 points, but Philly doesn't have to worry about being bounced in the first round, because with a 35-40-7 record, this team's missing the playoffs. Not gonna lie, that's tough. This Flyers team went from getting bounced in the first round in back-to-back -back seasons to missing the playoffs with an abysmal record. There's levels to this. It was a slower year for Trevor, who's scoring 36 goals and 41 assists for 77 points. Philly wasn't any better this season, finished with an almost identical 35-39-8 record, and they're missing the playoffs for the second year in a row. Alright, no more messing around. I'd rather get bounced in the first round than miss the playoffs every year. Let's dial in and get back to our true potential. Zegers is having a better year, potting 34 goals while picking up 50 health for a team high 84 points and the streak of disappointment continues with the Flyers as they're finishing with a 37 36 and 9 record and they're missing the playoffs once again this is the year where everything turns around this season's where Philly gets back to competing for cups again although Zegers wasn't his usual self recording 28 goals and 43 assists for 71 points that won't matter as the Flyers are making it back to the playoffs with a 46-31-5 record and they're taking on the Hurricanes in the first round. After taking down the Hurricanes, Philly would go on a bit of a run, but they would be stopped in the conference finals to Detroit. And the worst part about all this is, the Ducks went on to win the Stanley Cup. You hate to see it. Trevor was fantastic in the playoffs, scoring 7 goals and 11 assists for 18 points. After a terrific playoff run led by Trevor Zegers, Philly decided to reward him by moving him to the second line. Not gonna lie, that's really disrespectful. It was a terrible season for Zegers. After being moved to the second line, he's only scoring 51 points consisting of 25 goals and 26 assists. The lack of production from Zegers luckily isn't hurting this team as they're making the playoffs with a 44, 32, and 6 record. Philly would go on another run in the playoffs, making it all the way to the conference finals where they would be stopped by the Rangers in 5 games. When it mattered most, Zegers performed, scoring 13 points in 15 games. At 35 years old, Trevor Zegers doesn't have too many years left to win a cup. If he wants to get another one, he's going to have to do it quick. It was a bounce back year for Trevor, who's scoring 18 goals and 49 assists for 67 points. After making it to the conference finals in back-to-back -back seasons, Philly's finishing with a 42, 27, and 13 record, and they're taking on the Penguins with the expectations of making it to the Stanley Cup final. The Penguins would be no issue for the Flyers, however, they would be stopped in their tracks by the eventual Stanley Cup champion. Champion New York Islanders. Meanwhile, the Anaheim Ducks are making it to the Stanley Cup Final. Trevor was almost non-existent in the playoffs, scoring only 3 points in 12 games. With only one year left on his contract, this could be Trevor Zegers' final chance at a Stanley Cup. At 37 years old, Trevor Zegers is having the worst season of his career, only picking up 43 points. With a 41, 31, and 10 record, the Flyers are taking on the Red Wings in the first round. The Flyers would have no problem with the Red Wings, but they would fall to the Boston Bruins in the second round. Trevor was better in the playoffs, but let's face it, the bar was set pretty low last season. In free agency, Trevor Zegers was on a two-year deal with the Calgary Flames to finish out his career, but we're not going to go over those years because they were pretty forgettable. And at 39 years old, Trevor Zegers has decided it's time to call it a career and retire. If you enjoyed this video, I definitely recommend checking the one out on screen, and if you haven't already, make sure to drop a like and subscribe.